Hi everybody, thanks for stopping by for Recorder Club part two. Um, I had an overwhelming response to Recorder Club part one. Um, not always overwhelmingly positive, but always overwhelmingly funny. So um, thank you for all your comments in Seesaw. They have really, really made me smile. Um, so we're gonna learn two more notes today. If you haven't already watched the Recorder Club part one video, I really, really, really suggest that you go back and watch it because it talks about how to hold your recorder nicely and how to blow really, really gently. So you're getting a really nice musical sound, not that horrible screechy, whistly recorder sound. And it also talks about um, using your tongue to do a gentle t -t -t on every note so you get a nice sound. So if you haven't watched it, just pop back and watch the first one before you finish this one. Um, we're going to learn a new note. We're going to learn the note A. So holding the same as we did last week, we're going to put our thumb on the back. We're going to put our first finger on, just like we did a B. And then we're also going to put our second finger on. This, two fingers on your left hand, is an A. So here's a B. A. So remember what we said when we were reading music. B is on the middle line. A is in the space below. So B is on the middle line. A is on the space below. What is on the middle line? B. What is in the space below? A. So let me show you on this beginner recorder music. This one here is a B on the middle line. This one here is an A on your space below. Let's have a look at these rhythms. Last lesson we learned crotchets, we learned minims, and we learned a semi-breathe. Our crotchets were worth one B each, so we remember them T, 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 T. Our minims, these empty ones, are worth two beats. So we think B, B. Here we've got these little filled in crotchets. T, T, B. Then we have, I substituted, squash. Squash is worth a whole four beats. So this one goes. T, 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 B, B, T, T, B, squash. Now, this is in the space below. So we start off by playing our A. A, 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 A. See this one goes up. B. A, A, B, A. So let's play it together so you can hear what it sounds like. This is the second line from your beginner's bounce worksheet. It goes. I'm going to clap while I say the notes so that you can practice along with me clapping. So it goes one, two, three, four. A, 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 B, A, A, B, A. Great. Now let's do it again. I'm just going to clap this time for you to play along to. Ready? One, two, Three, four. Okay, fabulous. So we have learned B, A, and now we're going to spell the word bag. We're going to learn a G. B. A, and third finger here, G. Now, 
let's have a look at the third line of music. Thinking about our rhythms here, we've got T, 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 B, B, T, T, oh, <laughs> B, squash. And this new note is on the second line. So this G note with our three fingers on is on the second line up. We have B is on the middle line, A is in the space below, G is on the next line down, B, A, G. So this little piece of music here goes G, 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 A, B, A, G, A. Let's play it. This is the third line of music next to the G. Clap along and I'm going to say the notes out loud for you so you can practice. Ready? One, two, three, four. G, 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 A, B, A, G, A. Okay, once more. Without me saying the letters, just clapping. One, two, three, four. Now, what we're going to try and do, just to finish off this video, is we're going to try and put the three lines that we've learnt together, so we're getting one longer piece of music. Okay, so from the beginning, starting on the B line at the top, we're going to play all three lines that we've learnt so far. So after four, one, two, three, four. Okay, so please, please, please don't forget that you can rewind these videos. You can go backwards and forwards and listen to little bits. You can go back to the first video and do that one again. Um, just practice until you feel happy and comfortable playing it, until it starts to sound like the ones that I'm playing. Um, do upload your videos onto Seesaw. I also really love some people drew some diagrams for me, the how to hold the recorder. Um, what the notes look like, they practice drawing the notes, um, they made me record a posters and things. So if you're a little bit shy and you worry about sending me a video, if you want to just um, make me some posters, draw me some diagrams, find some other ways of doing recorder card, please do. Remember that you don't have to do these, this is for only people that are interested in um, starting to learn music and playing the recorder. Um, but I hope lots of you will join in and I'm going to start putting some slightly more advanced videos up here as well. So if you look in the little YouTube playlist, um, there will be a few more things for you to practice along too. Thanks everybody, hope you're keeping well, keep safe, bye.